A proposal for a marijuana business in Royal Oak ran into a roadblock tonight. A divided planning commission voted against a special permit that would have allowed it to be near a school. 7 Action News reporter Nana St. Jubonsu is live with the debate leading up to this vote. Nana. Yes, good evening. The room inside City Hall here behind me was filled with members of the community going back and forth on a hot topic that the planning committee just voted to not move forward with. Please, please, please not allow gas be to set up 300 feet from the OTSC. Both sides, people for and against the pot dispensary in Royal Oak, use three minutes to explain to leaders where they stand and why. I'm personally for this facility. I think it would be a really good neighbor to our nature park. Gatsby Cannabis Company is seeking a special land use permit and site plan to build a facility near Meyer Drive, north of West 14 Mile, just feet away from Oakland School's technical campus. I don't care about your facts. What I care about is my child. Parents don't believe a building where students from across the county come daily for classes in subjects varying from computer science, construction, culinary arts, and other vocational subjects is a place to grow and sell pot. You, the Royal Oak Planning Commission, please work with Gatsby Cannabis C in finding another building for their facility away from schools. A teacher in the county agrees. And as a fellow teacher, to not accept this site plan. The site is less than 100 feet away from OSTC. An attorney representing the cannabis company says they aren't breaking any laws. We respectfully request your positive recommendation to the city commission for approval of site plan and special land use. The law says marijuana businesses cannot be within a thousand feet of schools providing education, but according to the city, OSTC is technically not a school because of the curriculum. Parents and teachers disagree. That it is laughable to say that the thousand feet doesn't apply. Others in the community say, if not now, then when? The kids are going to know what cannabis is. It's around them in every city and everywhere they go. So why not explain it to them and understand what it is rather than try and shield them from it so they don't understand what it is and then they want to know and they're not exposed to it. Now, Carolyn, even though the planning committee voted to not move forward with this permit, we're told that city council can still pick up where they left off. A mother we spoke with today, she said, you know, yes, she's happy the planning committee did not move forward with, but she feels like this is a debate that's going to continue. And we'll just have to keep you posted on it. Nana Stancio Bonesu reporting for 7 Action News. All right. Thank you so much, Nana.